Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I just wanted to give you a quick tour of my little like potting area I set up in the basement. So it's not going to be super glam, but it works for me and I wanted to show you kind of like what I did. So the first thing I have here is this desk that I picked up for free on Craigslist. And it's just like a fiberboard one, so I had to keep it inside. I ideally wanted this to be outside like a potting bench, but the rain would have destroyed this within like a month. So for right now I'm doing it in the basement. So I'm just going to start up top. I have some decorative items up here. That little wooden box is something that my grandfather had when he was doing his gardening and then some just metal tins. Um, the ceiling above it, that's like insulation, so just ignore that. So here I keep extra pots. Right now I just have that one because I potted everything from my window box. That's what was originally sitting there. Over here I have my vintage gardening books. Those are some bottles. I went on a hike and there was like, I guess like an old junkyard type thing in the middle of the woods and they were all in there. The two shorter ones are actually still full of stuff. I couldn't get the lids off. So I just thought they looked kind of cool sitting there. Then in here I have extra plant markers. The next shelf down I have a little empty greenhouse. I have all my oil cans that I found at a yard sale and then back in the corner just came off of one of the screen doors I used for my outside project. But I liked the green paint chippy finish so I just stuck it in there. Now here is where I keep all like my plant foods and fertilizers. I'll just go through them real quick. So this one here I use when I'm putting something new in the ground. I just kind of sprinkle some in and then you sprinkle around the drip line of the plant. And I found this through the channel Garden Answer. Um, if you don't watch her and you're into gardening, you really should. That's pretty much where I learned how to do everything. And then this here is some worm castings that I just use like when I'm doing potting soil to make the soil a little better. This is rooting hormone. Um, this is for like experiments I'm doing to see what I can get to grow. This one here is a miracle Grow one that I showed you guys. It hooks to the end of the hose and this thing is amazing. Um, now I know you're supposed to buy the refill bottles, but I take it apart. You can easily pry the top off and refill it from a bigger bottle. It's way more cost effective that way. So here I just have the things that I'm working on. That's my basket for weeding. That's one of the pots that a plant came out of. Over here I keep a terracotta pot to put tools in. I'm going to be planting this up today with some rosemary. This is that self-watering one I'm going to give a shot. And then underneath I keep the soil. In this drawer here I keep scissors and gloves. And then in these drawers I keep extra containers from all the plants I've bought. That way if I need them for these experiments that I talk about, I have stuff that I can try growing. That one's empty and that one's empty. Right here I have a little wooden box that I built to hold all like the weed whackers and shovel type tools. And then I just threw down an old rug here. You can see I've got the potting soil. I'm getting ready to mix uh, the potting soil with the worm castings to do my rosemary. And then right here I just have like a project table. It's covered with like paint and stuff. And these are the things that I have to work on soon. So I have the bird feeders that got ripped down and broken. You can see this one got split here. That one keeps getting torn apart. And then I have this really cool gas can that I picked up at a yard sale. And then this one here that I just have to drill some drainage holes in the bottom. But yeah, this is what I have set up right now. And it's actually been working really well. Um, hopefully next summer I'll be able to have an outdoor one. Oh, and then on the side here, I just put some hooks to hang my like garden meal knee pad and then a little broom handle that I can just uh, sweep off the desktops when they get dirty. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video.